If you're watching this video, it's because you've chosen to live your best Cirrus life in this unique world of personal aviation. And I'm gonna go out on a limb and guess that you've probably chosen to fly for yourself because it's fun and empowering and overall very convenient. Plus, when it comes to getting around, I mean, let's be honest, there isn't too much out there that's safer than flying around in your Cirrus, as long as you're prepared and proficient. But as rare as it would be that you'd ever experience some in-flight emergency or abnormal situation, just remember that this world of personal aviation ultimately exists within a familiar universe that's still subject to the usual laws of statistics and chance, you know, like the chance that however slim, some external factor someday may cause an error to sneak in past your primary defenses. It's that minimal yet ever-present risk that you prepare for every single time you, I don't know, drive a car, ride your bike, or even just take a stroll down the sidewalk. The risk that something, somewhere, may not go exactly according to pan, to go exactly, Cut. what? Son. So Move it over. Go exactly, what is that? Uh, tornado. Tornado. Go. Should we go? Exact, whoa! What's up? Can not go exact, really? Sorry. Can not go exact, whoa, 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 oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You okay? The chance that something somewhere, you good? That it may not go exactly according to plan. Now, the good news is, most of the time, when things don't follow the plan, with a thoughtful approach, risks and errors can be identified, many times even predicted, and then mitigated and or trapped completely. And that's what this course was made for. To help you learn and exercise a prescribed methodology for first identifying and then responding to any emergency or abnormal situation that could come your way. Now, of course, it would never be possible to cover all risks and contingencies associated with flying, but being proficient with that generalized emergency abnormal methodology and subsequent workflow, that's gonna best prepare you to effectively mitigate an in-flight issue. So, you're officially invited to join your good pals in the Cirrus Approach training team for well over three hours of high quality video instruction, leading you through a detailed course of training that will look at some of the categorical areas that the Cirrus Approach team has identified as posing some of the more critical risk potential that you may experience during your everyday flying. Now over seven lessons, we're gonna take a look at engine power and fire issues, potential cabin emergency issues, electrical and avionics malfunctions, and how to best deal with all of that using a deliberate approach that's backed up by a very prescriptive checklist. Then we're gonna finish the whole thing off with the spin master himself. Easy for you to say. World-renowned aerobatic pro, as well as Cirrus standardized instructor pilot, Mike Goulian, for some good insights into best practices for spin avoidance, detection, and ultimately spin recovery. But did I mention spin avoidance? That's really the key. Anyways, up first is the essentials lesson. We're gonna to learn to refine your decision-making process, a skill that, when honed correctly, will be your first line of defense when it comes to minimizing risk and trapping errors. So, let's get after it. Welcome to the Cirrus Aircraft SR Series Emergency and Abnormal Course.